Will having an alcoholic drink with peanuts prevent a crash from happening? Let's find out. Today I'm having 60ml vodka with 120ml soda along with 30 grams peanuts. Now in this entire series, no matter what mixer we've chosen, blood sugar levels have eventually fallen below baseline because of the alcohol. And that's not a good feeling because it gives me a headache and makes me feel very uncomfortable. So let's see if having a drink with peanuts can finally prevent the crash from happening. Ice is melted but cheers. Okay, let's see what my glucose monitor says. Minus 14 mg? This means that peanuts did not help enough because my blood sugar levels clearly still fell below baseline. In fact, this is similar to when I had a vodka soda on its own without eating anything where the fall was minus 13 mg. Although I have to say that I felt the best when I had a drink with peanuts and that amazingly can be seen in the shape of the graphs also. If you see the plain vodka soda graph, I had my drink at 4 and for the next 3 hours my blood sugar levels fell continuously until I ate something. And that's why I expect experienced low blood sugar symptoms like a headache, irritability and hunger throughout this time. Whereas here my blood sugar fell initially and then it somewhat stabilized because of the peanuts. I guess this is why they say not to drink on an empty stomach and to at least snack on something while drinking. And clearly a little bit of peanuts do help but they're not enough. We need to be having something more substantial. 